a career orientation seminar that was organized by the DEFA team that just passed a few weeks ago was a very interesting career orientation seminar where advanced level students from different schools in Yaoundé came to the main venue where the program held which was at Polytechnic Yaoundé and were oriented about life after the advanced level and also about competitive entrance examinations into the various prestigious professional schools we have in our national territory so i will just try to display to you guys how the program look like and then we go into the main events that we have today so you see um we have engineer maxwell who is a student engineer from the national advanced school of public works he presented about engineering as a whole we also have um, dr shelter who is a fifth year medical student at the faculty of health sciences in bamenda who is currently on internship he presented about medicine in general now many other things also happened during the um, career orientation seminar where students were um, actually brought together to know more about life after the advanced level we also had um, an English teacher who is also a book writer who was there to encourage the students and give them some word of advice. We also had some games along the line where students competed and some few questions were being asked and all the rest. Now we had some um, pictures after the main events and all they like and all they like. So basically that's what the seminar was all about i cannot say everything but um for those who actually attended the seminar they can testify more how the seminar was swift all right so in this video mainly i'm going to be giving you guys a career orientation concerning engineering so basically i'm going to talk about the engineering schools that exist in cameroon and um actually maybe also the concourse that is a competitive entrance examinations into these engineering schools anyways in the next slide you are going to see the presentation plan now i am myself ken elsin i'm a student engineer at the national advanced school of public works in yaoundé and i'm going to be presenting to you guys basically about engineering schools in cameroon so for the presentation plan firstly i'm going to talk about the engineering schools in the different regions of cameroon secondly when these entrance examinations are going to be written thirdly the requirements or the subjects written in these entrance examination and lastly the engineering fields offered by these schools so basically these four points are going to appear chronologically whenever a school is being listed so let's begin with the center region in the center region we begin with the main big professional schools we have the national advanced school of engineering yaoundé which is polytechnic yaoundé as we all know now the various fields that are being offered in this school we have computer engineering we have mechanical engineering we have electrical engineering we have civil engineering we have telecommunication engineering and uh, industrial engineering as well as digital arts and digital humanities for the art students all right when is this concur going to be written it's going to be written on wednesday the 20th of july 2022 and how is the paper structured simply it is divided into two main subjects mathematics and physics now um there are some basic requirements that are being needed by students or candidates that are preparing for this concourse basically just your advanced level mathematics and physics is being asked nothing for the ordinary level so that's that for polytechnic young now the second prestigious school in the center region is the national advanced school of public works yaoundé and the major fields that have been offered we have the two sections which um constitute masters in engineering that's we abbreviate it as mensch 
the fields there we have civil engineering environmental engineering land survey and town planning now the second section of this school that is MASH masters in architecture simply it offers architectural engineering now when is this concours going to be written for MESH, which is masters in engineering is going to be written on Sunday the 4th of September 2022 and for March which, which is masters in architecture is going to be written on Sunday the 11th of September 2022 how is the paper structured simply into four different subjects you have mathematics physics chemistry general knowledge and language so general knowledge and language we actually pair it together general knowledge is basic and then language is both languages english and french and the concours is mcq all right let's move on to the third prestigious professional school in the center region which is the national advanced school of post telecommunication and ict in yaounde we generally call it as subtik yaounde all right the major fields that have been offered in this school we have telecommunication engineering and post inspectorate when is the concours going to be written telecommunication engineering is going to be written on tuesday the 16th of august 2022 while post inspectorate is going to be written on wednesday the 17th of august 2022 all right how is the paper structured mathematics physics and french are the three subjects that have been written in this concours now other concours in the center region or other um, not really concours um, other professional schools we have a private university called the Sianzu university where um, almost all the engineering fields are being offered in this university likewise we have the ict university in the center region all right let's move on to the littoral and the west region so the first school we begin with um schools in the littoral region we have the national advanced school of engineering duala which offers fields such as civil engineering mechanical engineering electrical engineering robotic engineering intelligent systems and telecommunication engineering as well as industrial engineering when is the concours going to be written on sunday the 31st of july 2022 and how is the paper structured is divided into two sections the mathematics section and the physics section all right let's go to the next school in the um littoral region which is the university institute of technology duala we generally call it iut duala the fields offered in this school we have computer engineering mechanical engineering electrical engineering software engineering thermal and energy engineering as well as industrial engineering when is the concours going to be written it's going to be written on tuesday the 4th of october 2022 how is the paper structured divided it into two subjects we have mathematics and physics now um in the west region we talk about the faculty of agronomy and agricultural sciences that is FASA under the university of chang which is in the west region now the, the fields offered we have two basic fields we have agro agronomy and forestry now when is this concours going to be written on sunday the 27th of august 2022 how is the paper structured biology which is mainly plant biology chemistry physics and general knowledge other concourse or other um, professional schools or other competitive entrance examinations regarding the faculty of agronomy and agricultural sciences we also have the faculty of agronomy and agricultural sciences in ebolova that is faza and we also have it as well in bafia all right in the northwest region and in the southwest region we have some prestigious um professional schools so we begin with the main ones so for the southwest region we we have the faculty of engineering and technology under the university of boya we call it fed boya it offers three main major engineering fields we have electrical engineering computer engineering and civil engineering now when is the concours going to be written on tuesday the 8th of september 2022 how is the paper structured it is divided into two sections 
the mathematics and the physics section mathematics generally is 80 mcqs and physics as well 80 mcqs the second school we talk about the college of technology boya that is called boya which offers fields such as mechanical engineering computer engineering and electrical engineering when is the congo going to be written it's going to be written on wednesday the 21st of september 2022 and the paper is divided into two sections mathematics and physics now it should be noted that these concourse in this um, northwest and the southwest region though we have just listed for the southwest region for you to actually gain access into these professional schools probably you begin by writing the competitive entrance examination into these professional schools but then you require some basic needs now for the advanced level you need mathematics and physics for the ordinary level you need pass in four subjects excluding religious studies and including english language all right so for the south for the northwest region we have the main big professional school the national higher polytechnic institute bamenda that is nhpi bamenda the major fields we have electrical engineering computer engineering civil engineering architecture and the concourse is going to be written on thursday the 15th of september 2022 the paper is structured into mathematics and physics now we also have the college of technology which is under the university of bamenda that is called tech the major fields you have computer engineering electrical and electronic engineering environmental engineering when is the congo going to be written start today the 24th of september 2022 how is the paper structured mathematics and physics all right all that other professional schools that are in the northwest and the southwest region we have the national polytechnic university institute bambui npui bambui we have higher institute of technology of central africa which is in douala so this is actually in douala that's yukak douala we have um udm which is in bangante so next we have regions that is the far north the south the east and the north region the professional schools or the prestigious professional that are present in these regions all right we begin with um one of the main which is in Gaoundere, the school of geology and mining engineering that is asian the fuels offered we have mining engineering petroleum and gas engineering the date to be written sunday the 23rd of october 2022 how is the paper structure mathematics physics chemistry and general knowledge the second we have still in Gaoundere, exim the school of chemical engineering and mineral industries the fuels offered mining engineering as well as petroleum and gas engineering when is the congo going to be written saturday the 29th of october 2022 and it has the same paper structure as AGM as we have previously seen. All right, we have FMIP, which is under the University of Marwa, that is a faculty of mines and petroleum industries. The fuels offered we have mining engineering, petroleum and gas engineering. The date to be written starts today, the 15th of October 2022, and the paper structure it is actually mathematics and physics so chemistry and general knowledge are not involved all right um the next school we have the national advanced school of polytechnic marwa which is under the university of marwa the fuels we have civil engineering and architectural engineering we have hydraulics engineering we have it and telecommunication engineering it here stands for in information um technology we have environmental engineering as well when is when is it going to be written on saturday the 8th of october 2022 and how is the paper structure please it is mathematics and physics chemistry general knowledge and language are not involved in the competitive entrance examination into the national advanced school of polytechnic maru 
So other institutes, we have the Higher School of Economics and Commercial Sciences in Garua, ESSEC Garua. The Konku date is not yet is not yet fixed for now. We also have the Higher Institute of Agriculture, Wood, Water and Environment in Betwa, Isabi. The Konku date is not yet fixed. We also have the National Advanced School of Agro Industrial Sciences in Sai in Gaundere. The Konku date is not yet fixed. And we also have Isabi, which is in Ebolova. The Konku date is not yet fixed. So basically that was it for engineering schools in Cameroon, the basic engineering schools in Cameroon. Um, the subjects that have been written in these engineering schools, where these engineering schools have been located and the fields that are offered in these engineering schools. So thanks for your keen attention and I hope you enjoyed the lesson. See us in the next video.